Hello community, this is Andy Menon back with another video from the RPA Vanguard channel. Today we'll take a look at how to work with the offline mode in UiPath Assistant. Normally we are always online with the assistant connected to the orchestrator. For a change today, we'll disconnect from the orchestrator and see how things work in the offline mode. What I'm going to show you works in the community edition of Studio. I'm yet to test this fully in the Enterprise Edition. With that, let's get started. Right, what this automation does is simply open up the UiPath page in a browser window, maximize that window, pause for a while, and then close the browser window. I will be using this example to demonstrate the offline feature of the UiPath Assistant. You can substitute this with one of your own packages for the purposes of testing. To understand the offline mode, let me first demonstrate what options are available to us when deploying a package in the online mode. Typically, when you are connected to the orchestrator and initiate a package deployment, you have the following options. The orchestrator tin and feed option. Most of us must be familiar with this. In this case, your package will be deployed to the tenant you're currently connected to. And then there's the custom option, in which case you can publish the package to a location of your choosing on your computer. I will not be doing an online deployment for this demo because most of us know how this works. So I'm going to exit out of the screen and I'll be back after taking my UiPath environment offline. OK, I'm back. I've taken the studio and assistant offline. And one thing to note is that I restarted studio after disconnecting from the orchestrator. Now let me initiate the package deployment in the offline mode and take a look at what the publish options has to offer. This time, we have the assistant robot defaults option in place of the orchestrator tin and feed option you saw from earlier. The custom option, however, does not change. As seen, the UiPath Assistant is a clean slate. There's nothing in here because I don't have any offline deployments, not yet. So let me go ahead and deploy the package by choosing the Assistant Publish option and see what happens. And here's where your package will be deployed in the offline mode. And the package appears in the assistant. Great. Now, let me run the automation in the offline mode. Nice, it works. One thing to remember though, is that this package will not be visible to you if you go online. The automations you will see are the ones from your orchestrator or custom package feed. Obviously, this means that you have to be back in the offline mode in order to get access to this automation once again. I hope this is one more thing you learned today on your UiPath RPA journey. And please, please, please like and subscribe to this baby channel so that it may grow to be successful in providing useful content to the community. Thank you.